It began in July when Goya Foods CEO Robert Unanue complimented President Trump about the expansion of the Hispanic Prosperity Initiative. We're all truly blessed at the same time to have a leader like President Trump, who is a builder. And that's what my grandfather did. He came to this country to build, to grow, to prosper. And so we have an incredible builder, and we pray. We pray for our leadership, our president, and we pray for our country that we will continue to prosper and, and to grow. After hearing those words, critics jumped on social media calling for a boycott of the company, which claims to be the largest Hispanic-owned food company in the United States. That's when this man stepped in. Casey Harper launched a GoFundMe campaign entitled, Buy Goya, Support Trump and Feed the Hungry, to turn the boycott into what he called a boycott. His efforts really paid off. Thus far, some 9,000 donors have contributed more than $300,000, blowing past Harper's original $10,000 goal. Harper, a producer for the TV show America This Week with Eric Bowling, documented part of the boycott. And that means it's time for a Goya shopping spree. He also reached out to CBN's Operation Blessing to help distribute the Goya products. Operation Blessing's Hunger Strike Force accepted the assignment. Several truckloads of Goya products made their way to the Operation Blessing Distribution Center in Chesapeake, Virginia, before they head to the D.C. area, Texas and Florida. And that's not all. They want us to be able to reach from the state of Texas and the state of Florida. We'll be reaching all of our partners within those two states as well. And then from Texas, we're going to be reaching out into Arizona and Oklahoma and the surrounding states there where we have ministry partners. In addition, there are plans to send food to the Navajo and Cherokee Native American people. O'Grady tells CBN News that each of the three distribution centers are expected to ship out more than 80,000 pounds of Goya products. During these challenging times when you're looking for resources as, as hard and as quick as you can to be able to take care of the people who are in need, it's just such an honor and, and, and a fulfilling experience just to know that we've been chosen as one of those partners by Goya Foods. And without Goya, we wouldn't be able to do what we do. And Goya itself is working to get food out to families who need it. The Working for Our Country Goya Gives campaign will distribute 2 million pounds of food across the U.S. and Puerto Rico. Mark Martin, CBN News, Chesapeake, Virginia.